These are the rules of divisibility. These are the rules of divisibility. These are the rules. Divisibility! A number is divisible by two if it's even. A number is divisible by two if it's even. What about 34,578? Well, eight is an even number. So 34,578 is divisible by two. What about 5,900,872,324? Four is an even number. So 5,900,872,324 is divisible by 2. A number is divisible by 3 if the sum of the digits is divisible by 3. A number is divisible by 3 if the sum of the digits is divisible by 3. What about 462? 4 plus 6 plus 2 equals 12, which is divisible by 3, so 462 is divi divisible by 3. What about 51? Well, 5 plus 1 equals 6, and 6 is divisible by 3, so 51 is divisible by 3. A number <laughs> is divisible by 4. If the digits in the ones and the tens place form a number that is divisible by 4. A number <laughs> is divisible by 4. If the digits in the ones and the tens place form a number that is divisible by 4. What about 516? Um, 1 and 6 form the number 16, and 16 is divisible by 4, so 516 is divisible by 4. What about 3,682,132? 3 and 2 form 32, so 32 can be divided by 4. So, 3,682,132 is divisible by 4. A number is divisible by 5 if there's a 0 or a 5 in the 1's place. A number is divisible by 5 if there's a 0 or a 5 in the 1's place. What about 95? There's a 5 in the 1's place, so 95 is divisible by 5. What about 672,830? Well, there's a zero in the ones place, so 672,830 is divisible by five. A number, a number is divisible by six. It is divisible, divisible by both two and three. A number, a number is divisible by six. It is divisible by both two and three. What about 420? This number ends is even because it ends in zero, which means it's divisible by two. When I add up the numbers four, two, and zero, I get six, and six is divisible by three. So that means 420 is divisible by both two and three, which means it's divisible by six. What about 804? Well, the four is in the ones place, so that, that make, and four is an even number, so that makes it divisible by two. And how you figure out it's divisible by 3 is you add the 4 and the 8, and that makes 12, and you don't really need to count the 0. 12 is divisible by 3, so that makes this number divisible by both 2 and 3, and that makes this number divisible by 6. A number is divisible by 9 if its sum of its digits is divisible by 9. A number is divisible by 9. If the sum of its digits is divisible by 9. What about 72? Well, 7 plus 2 is 9, and 9 is divisible by 9. So 72 is divisible by 9. What about 453,231? Well, 4 plus 5 plus 3 plus 2 plus 3 plus 1 equals 18, and 18 is divisible by 9. So 453,231 is divisible by 9. A number is divisible by 10 if there's a zero in the ones place. A number is divisible by 10 if there's a zero in the ones place. So what about 3,890? 
Well, there's a zero in the ones place, so 3,890 is divisible by 10. What about 6,708,435,600? Well, there's a zero in the ones place, so 6,708,435,600 is divisible by 10. These are the rules of divisibility. These are the rules of divisibility.